Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Europa Universalis 4. We are back, and the war with Brunswick has just begun. The uh, League War of Sorts. We grossly outnumber them, but right now we are contributing, well, basically no troops at all. Because our army got wiped out. Now, you may recall, some of this is some stuff we've seen before. But unfortunately, at the moment, um... Well, basically, it's, uh, we're just out of luck. So, <laughs> yeah, we've got to rebuild our army from that wipeout we had with Poland. Oh, yeah, I was going to peace out somehow. Can I get out of this? Probably not. That's okay. I think my friend, my allies are going to win this one for me. Yeah, maybe not. It's hard to say. Well, hopefully enough things go wrong for Poland that we can get out of it. In the meantime, basic force. We're going to do a little basic force recruitment setup here. We're going to do four, one, and one across six provinces. Okay, and that's going to start up in here because they'll gather up there. And we'll see what happens. New technology, more naval tech, we'll hold off on that. We're not... Oh, we are going to cap on Diplo Points bill soon. Darn it. Diplomatic buildings. Oh, not a lot, no. Well, I guess we build some grand shipyards. That should buy us a month or two. Oh, and we just cycled the year, too. You know what? Forget it. Let's get it. That was a lot of points, but I think we needed it. Okay. So we'll let them come in here and get started. Now, as for our allies, who do we have? We have Britain. We have the Netherlands. Bavaria. We've got people in a military coalition against us, which is a little unfortunate. Okay. Brunswick, you suck. We're going to have them sort of gather up there in preparation. I don't think they, any of these guys can mount enough of a fleet to be an issue, because they're mostly coastal people. But they're going to have a monster stack all in one place. Oh, the Netherlands, that's right. I did ally the Netherlands, didn't I? There was a distinct possibility I was going to be able to... No, they're too big to... Yeah. More than 40 base tax. So they're too big to vassalize. But you know what? That person might be okay in the short run. Okay. Here we go. Let's get our... All of our mercenaries recruited here. We're just recruiting everything here, just in case you guys were wondering. Get another cannon, and get the rest of the infantry as well. This is going to be an expensive, uh, expensive month. Okay, now as for allies, we've got Britain bringing 20 stack. Yay, Britain! Welcome to the party, man. Gonna bring all these guys down here to the front is now gonna be right there. Excellent. Britain brought their army in right away, which is perfect. How's it going for lose diplo power or lose min power? I got more diplo power right now. Okay. Britain is taking on a 40 stack right now. That is not good. And I can't afford to come help them yet. Dag nabbit. I'm sorry, Britain. You jumped in just a little sooner than I would have liked. Okay, become an army. Take my one leader. Okay. 
What is their war goal? Battles. We're one up, one to one. I'd love to get out of that, but I think that's just not going to happen right now. Muscovy is actually the war leader. Let's just let it go. Did Muscovy come in on this one? Yes, they did. So I don't want to make them unhappy with us. Come on, mercenaries. Man, everybody's joining a coalition against us. That is terrible. Fortunately, we're already in one coalition war now, as it is. Are you retreating to a ship, Britain? Oh, you suck. Dude. Really? Dude. Lose Republican tradition or lose admin power. Loyalty to the Republic. And we are going to go with our military candidate to keep boosting our military idea group. All right, we're up to a 21 stack. We're now not at our force limit yet, which is good. We're just going to recruit more. Recruit some more. A couple more cannons. This is going to be a monster army, guys. All right. We've got to get ourselves in a position to win this. We cannot lose, afford to lose this war. This is the big one. So... Somebody's no longer a valid rival. Okay. Now, Britain, you buggered off, which sucks a lot. Alright, you tricked. Will you be kind enough to attach? All right, we'll have you attach in a minute. In fact, I'll just stay attached to that unit. And we'll tell any of our subjects you tricked to be supportive. Prices are on the way up. Merchants are struggling. Nope. Prices are on the way up because inflation will go away. Inflation will go away quite quickly thanks to my idea groups. All right, all I need now is one of my, one or two of my allies to get really into the party here. Now, if I play my cards right, I could make this a defensive war. That's a 33 stack of my own troops. And we are going to go down into... All right, time to say, hey, Poland. I'm sorry, but if, if I could be not involved with you... That would be very nice. Sorry, Muscovy, I really... I'm sorry. But if you can let me out of that... Okay, they've abandoned all their sieges, which is good news. Let's siege down uh, the capital of Brunswick. Ooh, excellent. This is something I need right here, is a small fight. Take it out. Excellent. All right, we'll get ready to beat Brunswick's army as it comes in here. We're going to intercept them. Yes, we are. No, nope, not quite. They're moving on, but we're going to catch them. They're going to get a tick of morale, but that's okay. The important thing is we're basically going to wipe out the coalition here. And we'll be able to start... Um, the process of uh, carpet sieging soon. And then Brunswick, we're going to just take the risk on the um, aggressive expansion here. Alright, you know what? I don't know where they went. We'll uh, split this in half. Alright, time to recruit another basic, couple basic forces. There we are. Excellent. And Utrecht is going to join one of my armies. Awesome. We are now checking our fleet. We need can recruit four more, so recruit the five. Perfect. But we are now in a position where we are having some pretty significant victory. We are going to gut Brunswick. Let's see who else is in this war. Are all of you part of the coalition? 
Yes, you're all coalition members. Okay. Well, we'll feed some of this to gel to uh, Utrecht and some of this to the Netherlands, maybe. I don't really need to feed anything to the Netherlands. Let's do some diplomatic improvement with Britain, because reasons right there. Okay. Oh, you guys are back, huh? You think so, do you? Oh, excellent. Detach Siege. Let's get this one. Two to one ratio. I think we can take them. Unless they have better morale than I do. Wow, really? We're going to lose this? No, we're not going to lose. We are going to lose. That's not good either. Oh, oh, a couple good rolls. That's all it's going to take. Oh, good. We won. I think we're going to have the ticking war score soon, which is good. That's another five stack. We were waiting for two five stacks, though, weren't we? Yes, we were. Okay. See, oh, that's Muscovy. Good. Our allies are starting to come into the party. I am sorry, Muscovy. I think I'd better spend a little time improving with you just to make up for the uh, abandonment I just pulled on you. Send that to Muscovy. Okay. Are you part of this goof? Are you part of the zoo? No, you're not. Excellent. We just took Brandenburg or uh, Brunswick's capital. Let's see. Yearly prestige plus one? Sure. Let's get him. That was easy. Let's see. Who else is in this zoo? Frankfurt? Well, Frankfurt's getting sieged down. Let's detach. Siege him. Thuringia, are you in this one? No, you're not. Okay. All right. I think we're almost at the point. Wurttemberg, you are in. Okay. We'll just maintain for now. Okay, you five, you ten down here. We should be a little over the force limit now. Yeah, but that's okay because we're going to be switching them out for... New idea. Ooh. Bill of Rights. Reduced unrest. Awesome. I would love, love, love to take on... Uh, hold on. Are you part of a coalition? You are in a coalition against me. How big is this second coalition? Coalition against... Just a second. Hello. Sorry about that. Always a little something going on. Okay, so our war is progressing quite nicely. Our goal is really just to completely trash these guys. We'll go up here, and then we'll detach down into Thuringia. Oh, oh, I take it back. There is an army here that needs some help. Come on, guys. We can't afford to lose this battle. This is an important one right here. This is like the battle. Get in there. Backup has arrived. Goodbye, Brunswick. Come on, wipe out. Alright, you guys are going to retreat to Hanover. Lose money, gain prestige. Yeah, we can afford to. We've got so much money coming in. So they should pause right there. We're going to run in and we are going to wipe them out. Come on, get them before the, before the tip. Yes! Wipe out. Awesome. That just made this a lot easier. I can promise you that. You guys merge, detach, go. 
detach. Go. Now, who else is involved in this little zoo? Ulm? Where's Ulm? Maintain with you as well. There's Wurttemberg. There's the Palatinate. Gain stability. Well, we don't need the stability. So, let's take... Where's our prestige? Low. So, 50 prestige is actually pretty good. That's a pretty good thing to have happen. Right there. Alright, and Halt is ours. So I'm leaning towards, let's see how much we can take from this, because I think we're going to just trigger another coalition war almost immediately here. Oh, I wish... Hold on, how I was going to look. How big is this uh, coalition here? Basically everybody else in the bloody empire. Am I still allies with... Uh... No, I'm not allies with you anymore. Because you hate my guts. If I declare war on you, Austria will come in on your side. So we're not going to do that. But we were thinking about declaring on Sweden. He will have... I will have nobody because mostly we're fighting together in a war already. So we need to clear our current war off the books first before we can start on something else. Oh, there's Ulm. Tucked into a corner there. Really don't care. <sighs> I just gotta be careful of my aggressive expansion. Mm. No, we're not gonna... We're gonna just deal with... Lose the mercenaries. Oh, he, oh my god. The Ottomans. That is not good at all. We are going to get annihilated by the Ottomans is what's going to happen. And you know what? That's okay. And you know, I, I, on, in all honesty, I'm going to be perfectly honest, I want to finish this war, and I think we're actually going to bring this series to a close. Um, the two or three of you who actually watch this, I, I know you're enjoying it, and I appreciate your viewership, but to be honest... Um, I just can't justify the time it takes to record um, this series. What is my current... I was looking for mission. Hanover. Perfect. Okay. So, we're simply going to have to say goodbye to this series. It's been fun. It's a good game. I love the game. But when it comes right down to it, a good game does not make it uh, something that I'm actually going to want to play. Or something that I can play. And that's okay. That's just part of life, and that's just part of life we're going to have to live with. <sighs> it's too bad, but, you know, they can't all be winners. Peace offer from Brunswick. I don't think so. Okay. It's just a shame that I can only um, negotiate with Brunswick on this one. I just want this war finished. Um, I expect we're going to see a, another coalition war very soon. But I really need this one to be finished before I, uh... And I would love to give that to, uh... I'd love to give that to, uh, Utrecht, but... Wow. The Ottomans terrify me. Absolutely terrifying. Come on, roll the dice. Reconvene our forces. There we are. That's the siege I really needed. Okay. Sue for peace. I want Hanover. Which is my mission. 32% overextension and a little bit of aggressive expansion. So we are going to pull out... I could just vassalize you? That's a huge quantity of aggressive expansion, but I could make that happen if I don't take if I don't take your land. Hundred and ten percent. Really? Okay, so it's only. I don't really care about Frankfurt. 
Oh, so close. But okay, so taking not Frankfurt, but Hanover will make it so that Brunswick is within conquest or a vassalization range next time around. War reparations. Force religion. Can't afford to do that. I'll take your treaties. I suppose I could force you to release um, an extra sovereign state in here. Cologne. And halt. Let's punch out uh, Magdeburg on the, on the border here. I think that could be useful. And as much money as I can get out of you, that's the best I'm going to be able to do because it's a coalition war. Let me have it. One mission complete. Perfect. Oh, massive unrest. Lose one stability and the Pope hates me. I don't care about the Pope. Alright, lose some stability and make the Pope hate me and make Hanover Protestant. Well, that was easy. And now we'll do the conversion. Now, um, you, Magdeburg, become my ally. Because I forced them to release you. And I should be able to vassalize you, given a sufficient uh, relationship quality. Ah, uh, too bad. They've, they came out Catholic. Um... No. Oh, Magdeburg, have a guarantee. Costly trade embargoes. Oh, let's uh, revoke embargo, because I think they're not valid uh, rivalry targets anymore. Well, I guess Poland is going to be a necessary uh, rival. Okay. As for missions, army tradition, Crush Sweden. All I have to do is declare war on Sweden? Well, let's see. Will anybody come with me? That's an excellent question. Netherlands. Muscovy will not because they're fighting a war with the enemy. They like... They don't quite like me enough. <sighs> and the only one who's going to come help you is Cliffs and Riga. But if I do that, I could wind up in a nasty position. No, you know what? We're going to hold off. We're going to hold off on that. We will just improve those defenses. Osfrisland? Which one is that? There we are. And you need a next tier fort there, I think is what you wanted. All right. Okay, you guys. Detached mercenaries. There's our mercenary army there. And this is another mercenary army. So we're going to put all our mercs in one place. And all our normal troops in the other. And we're going to recruit two more basic forces right here in the core. And then we're going to start decommissioning our mercenary armies at the same time. Alright, there we are. So we can start by just getting rid of you guys. There we are. That'll at least get us below the force limit, I think. Not quite, no. Let's uh, get a split set up here. We're building them five at a time, so it seems sensible. There we are. There's four troops of five, and one of which we're going to disband immediately, because that will put us at the force limit. Yep. No sense in paying more than we have to, and we're getting rebuilding with our own troops now. We'll get rid of you as well. You guys are 
both normal troops, so you can go join. Seize the wealth. Okay. Alright, that's a mercenary troop. Just gonna get this cleaned up. Yeah, alright, you guys can go now. Because we've just got another force completed. It's coming. It's coming. Oh, hey. Our uh, force should be protecting trade in um, the north. Let's see. Let's get you to go. Let's send you to uh, Novigrad. And you are cogs. Okay. Force limit is reached once again. We're going to build another... The key thing is here is that we're digging into our manpower with this, but that's okay. We'll get a troop going there. So this one's becoming our core, which is good. It's got unlawful territory for quite some time here. Okay, well, we're almost at the point where we're going to call it a day and probably call it a series for now. Again, because I just don't have time. <laughs> I love I love this game. This, is so, this game is so much fun, but I just don't have the uh, interest to justify it. And you know what? I appreciate everybody who's watched this. I appreciate your interest. Come on. Oh, did we run out of points? Nope. Perfect. That's going to make it much cheaper to recruit troops in the future. Depletion of the European beaver. Oh, and the coalition is starting to come apart, which is good. All right, let's see where we're at with uh, troops. We can disband another five. 38, so this is going to be it. Other than a handful of troops to round it out. Perfect. Let's see, is there anything left? We could take one more. We're going to gather everybody together in one place and do a consolidation. Because this is sort of the last thing we're going to do. If, if there's interest, I mean... I wouldn't mind continuing this. My god. Bohemia, you terrify me now. Or, not Bohemia, but... One merge, and then we'll split you in half right down the middle. Excellent. Some army tradition. Okay. And the coalition is beginning to collapse. Prestige? Wow, our prestige is up there now. I don't need the money, so let's get the prestige. All right, now let's get what we're thinking I need. It's going to be a little while on that. A little while on any new technologies. Hmm, mission. I do need a new mission. Oh, I need to... That's right, I was going to recruit a, recruit a new general. Because my army tradition is up a bit. Eh, it's not great. Not bad, not great. Protect against Sweden. Larger army than Sweden. That's actually doable. Incorporate Utrecht. No, I want to keep Utrecht. Take Zeeland. That's something I actually want to do as well. Quick army. Tr nah, let's just... Uh, we'll take that, because that's going to be our next, next task. There we are. But for the moment... That is going to be it. I hope you've enjoyed the series, guys. This is going to go on uh, hiatus for the moment. Um, and we may pick this up again in the future if I get the energy and time to play. But right now, we're just not having the time and there isn't the interest. So that's all kinds of good. Come on, get back to what you were doing. You were projecting in Lubick, most likely. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, and I will see you when I see you.
Bye for now.